Hello and welcome. Today's video is going to show how to calibrate the camera on a TM series robot from Omron Electronics. My name is Ray Marquis. I am a senior application engineer with Valen. Let's get started. There are other utilities and tools that will show you how to start a project. We're not gonna start there. We're gonna start with doing the vision in the project. So we'll drop in a vision node and then edit it by clicking on the pencil. We'll click on the vision job and then create a new job by clicking the plus sign and then giving it a name. You can name whatever you want. No spaces are allowed. And then once you get your name in there, you'll just click on OK. Uh, you'll take a little delay and then come up to the vision tools here or the vision flow. Uh, as we go along, I might, might drag in the picture of the robot actually doing some work. Uh, right now, I'll just get it out of the way. We're going to start by clicking on the calibrate because we can actually see the image that we want to calibrate on, which is the provided calibration grid. And it's very simple. We'll just click on next in every step here. There's a next button and we'll just say, okay, we can see it. Let's make it next. We're going to click on no here that we want to go ahead and do the tilt calibration so that we can align the camera to the work surface, even if it's tilted. Now it's gonna ask me to click the play button on the teach pendant or the remote pendant. So I'm gonna pick that up, just click the play button and the robot will start moving all on its own. Moving around that grid to be able to determine the angle of the camera if it's not parallel with the work surface. And then you'll see the robot moving actually moving in this in space here and you'll see the image change as the camera view changes while the robot's moving around it'll take a few minutes and you'll watch the progress on this bar here and then through the magic of video editing i got this to finish and we say okay to go to the next step i'm just going to click on next and it says the workspace is confirmed so we just click on next again and now it's asking me to Hit the play button on the remote. So I'll just grab that, hit play, and it's gonna go through its little dance and move around again. And through the magic of video editing, once again, we're gonna save some time and I'll jump to the end of that process. But I'll let you watch a little bit of the movement. Everybody likes to see a robot move. So here you go. Okay, so we're almost done, but boom, then we're done tells us we're done and that it calibrated. So we just say, yes, we want to save the calibration. Then we save a workspace. The workspace you use later when you do the machine vision tools, for instance, finding a part so that you can pick it up, give it a name that you can remember, then say save, confirm this, that it's saved and that you're done. And then you can go on to doing your vision project and finding parts. That's it for now. Be sure to look for some other videos in the same series. And the robot and I say goodbye.